I'm like, guys, I just wanted to show this little project I made of some wires. I got a little thing of wires. And I made this at home. I've been kind of carrying it around. Um, don't know why I carried it around. Um, but I made something out of it that uh, I got inspired from Doc Ock, which is basically Doc Ock except wires that I have made. It's fully flexible. You can shape it. You can move its um, body however you want. And it's pretty cool. Here it is. Also, this video may not be edited pretty good. Um, things from this back are obviously Doc Ock's arms. On every uh, arm, there's his little claws. Copper wa um, wire, by the way, or bronze, whatever you want to call it. His actual body here, hand, oh, regular hands. Yeah, I think this is pretty cool. And I wanted to make the arms a little longer, but I didn't really, already long enough, I believe. Um, you can shape it however you want, like I said. His whole body, he can move, as you can see from me just shaking him. And there's, it's not the very stiff wires, it's kind of weak wires, which makes it easily move. So, and I build a ton of these um, wire characters. I'm planning on actually editing and making a video of how I make these wire characters. Um, the head's always the hardest part. It's a ball of wire. And it's pretty firm, too. I'm just trying to squish it. Barely any change. Um, but I try very hard to uh, make these. It takes me hours on end just to make this. And of course, it's not perfect. I wanted to make a ton of upgrades. Um, but this is always like a base. I have so many wire characters. There's some on my table, on like a table in my room. Uh, and baskets. I have made so many of them. It's insane. And I need to get rid of a bunch of them because a bunch of them. Uh, 